Hi, welcome back to this bootcamp on behavioral change. In this third model, we're going to introduce a framework called the Five Levers of Change. It was developed by Unilever, and it's a very pragmatic, simple framework to help you design an effective behavioral change campaign. The first lever, make it understood. You have to help your target group to understand the good behavior and also explain why it's good. At the base of the pyramid, this means you probably need to use local languages, a lot of visuals, and look for local metaphors. Second lever, make it easy. People will always choose the path of the least resistance. So you have to make it very easy for people to start adopting the new behavior. And this often means you can also make it more fun to practice it. For example, introducing a new local dance or a new song to engage people can have a great impact in adopting this behavior. Third lever, make it desirable. People at the base of the pyramid have great aspirations. So you need to involve local opinion leaders or their peers so they can start practicing your behavior and be a great example also for your target group. Fourth lever, make it rewarding. As mentioned in the first module, rewards are very important. You have to start rewarding people from day one if they practice the intended behavior. And rewards don't always have to be monetary. Providing social recognition in their community, for example, can be of much greater value than monetary rewards. Fifth lever, make it a habit. In order to make your campaign sustainable, make sure that it turns into a habit. And with the increased adoption of mobile phones and social media in these countries, it can provide a lot of opportunities to remind people at the right time and at the right occasion to practice the intended behavior. In this week's model, you'll find a lot of inspiring examples of campaigns that use the five levers of change. Take some great ideas, steal them, and start designing your own behavioral change campaign. Enjoy.